guys it's Casey welcome to another video and in today's video I'm going to be doing a review on Love Life in the List by Casey West. Now originally I did receive an eARC of this from the publisher in exchange for an honest review that doesn't affect my opinion of the book whatsoever. I then purchased a physical copy because Casey West is like my queen when it comes to contemporary so I always always just buy her books anyway so I'm supporting the publisher I'm supporting the author but I did originally get this review as an eog. So I finally got around to reading this and this is the story of Abby and she is a hardcore like artist. She wants to be in this sort of like program but she is told by like her teacher that her drawings aren't quite mature enough. Like she is too immature to be in this and so she's sort of like well how can I do that and he just said well you don't really put like too much emotion in it in in your drawings and um she's just like oh okay so she goes home and she's like you know what i'm going to create this list of things to do that will help me to get emotion and once i experience those emotions then i can put them into drawings so she creates a list so things like you know falling in love having your heart broken hearing a stranger's story doing something new doing something out of your comfort zone that sort of thing and every time she does one of these things she draws a picture to do with it and i really like that it had a really sort of like road trippy feel with it and i really like that this also at the same time she has got a best friend called connor who she has been absolutely in love with ever since she has known him she told him about a year ago that she had feelings for him and he didn't reciprocate those feelings so ever since she's been trying to get over him but she's finding it really really difficult he is sort of like going out with this girl that he meets when she's with her and she's just like mm. and then this girl isn't very nice she's sort of like is telling her to like back off and everything and so she's just like uh, and then when she brings it up with connor he's just like uh yeah sometimes connor did really like irritate me in this book and i found that a lot of people when they when reading this they did find the same they were just like mm, yeah connor was a bit of a dick like several times and to be honest i do agree i liked how he was like at the end like he's not my favorite like guy that you know book boyfriend sort of thing like he he seemed pretty decent but yeah i mean i love all of casey west's book but i'd say this one i i really really sort of like liked the the art and the road trippy style of it but to be honest like the romance part like with connor he was quite a dick for like the majority of it and he's so freaking blind to the, f the fact that like abby's just there and it's just like come on man just like she's right there she's she loves you she'll be everything for you she's just like oh just come on just seriously so yeah he was a bit of an oblivious idiot but you know in the end it all like sorted itself out so i'm hoping that he like redeems himself big time after this book but yeah just yes the story of like them getting together but as well as her achieving this art and then um she she has um like lots of like art things that happen like and the the showcase and everything and all happens in this book too so yeah um i really like abby as a character but like i say connor was just a bit of a dig like several times just he just he really needs to just sort himself out but i really like this book because of the art sort of it so it's probably so far maybe my my least favorite book of casey west but i still really really enjoyed it if that makes sense like i still gave it five out of five kick hats i still recommend it but i i really really liked it because i just love casey west's writing and she always hooks me I always find her books hard to put down and that's another reason why I'm rating it as well and I really liked Abby as a character it's just that the fact that Connor was a, a sort of like let down character and I sort of sometimes I was just like what does she see in the sky but then there's other times when when they're together they they just they just should be together sort of thing so then I'm just like well it makes sense sort of thing so he's just he's just a guy basically <laughs> so just basing on my own life experiences like he's just being a guy so maybe he's written very well in that sort of sense but yeah i like i say really really enjoyed it five out of five kit kats i totally recommend it like i say really really enjoy casey west's writing style another book 
cracked off on my list I really really enjoyed it and if you like art if you like sort of like road trippy um, things then it's kind of like art with a road trip in it that's probably the best way that I can describe this book but yeah I, I really liked it and um, yeah I hope you guys will too if you do pick it up but yeah that's that's it from me so if there's anything else you'd like to know about this book do let me know down below in the comments if you have enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you're new to my channel please feel free to subscribe i post videos pretty much all the time at the moment i've got so many videos to post i'm trying to like do a little sort of like schedule with my videos and it seems to be working so far this year so are you okay with that all of my social media links are linked down below in the description if you'd like to follow me elsewhere but that's it for me guys keep smiling keep reading and be happy and stay safe my name is Katie and I will see all of you wonderful, awesome people in my next video. Bye!